This is the Henry Wade Juvenile Justice Center in West Dallas, where Ashley Lively's 15-year-old son has been held in detention since February. She says sometimes in isolation. They were sitting in their cells sometimes for two days. I know he didn't go outside until he was in there probably a month and a half. Just one of numerous complaints from parents that have made it all the way to Austin. The Office of the Inspector General announcing it will conduct a broad review of neglect allegations associated with the detention of juveniles within the Dallas County Juvenile Detention Center. Dallas County Commissioner well, Andy uh, Summerman. I would assume you, you welcome the news of this investigation. Is that, is that fair to say? Yeah, we, we absolutely. I invite this investigation. Uh, we need to have a clear understanding of what is happening over there at the juvenile department. Summerman and other Dallas County commissioners have been at odds with the juvenile department, fighting each other in court over access to juvenile records that he says might shed light on issues including how long children are kept in isolation. And this is before they are convicted of any crime and presumed innocent. The executive director of the juvenile department tells WFAA they have been notified of the investigation. And as always, his staff will be open and transparent with all requests by the office of the inspector general. That's what Ashley Lively wants to hear with her son now held five months in juvenile detention. I just hope they do a thorough and honest investigation. Let the public know actually what's really going on there. In Dallas, I'm Kevin Reese.